Hey guys, just going to finish up this fan-made documentary with Kabaru Miku. Uh, she's my favorite, guys. Uh, I just, you know, broke this up because it just makes for uh, a shorter video for people to watch. I don't ever react to, as you guys know, long videos because nobody watches them. Uh, it's just easier to break it up. So again, I hope to see uh, your reactions. Send them, send them to uh, my email uh, and with the information you want in the the description and I'll happily post it right here for you guys let's make it your channel for real guys I always say it's our channel so let's make that happen no other reaction channel is gonna do that I'm sure so this channel is about the music it's about you guys so let's do it uh, I can't wait I hope somebody does it I really want to see some reactions from uh, from you guys out there so it'd be super cool all right, let's finish this up. Well, this is now the time to end our journey with Miku. Oh, no. Yes. Our journey never ends Already. with Miku. It's been a long journey, though. Well, she went through a lot. She had to live without a father very early in her life. Thankfully, Miku's mother and grandmother were here for her at that time. And Miku is so tough. Even though she sometimes talks about her dark thoughts, she always did her best to overcome them, move on with her life, and never give up. As soon as she knew that she wanted to become a singer, Miku did everything to reach her goal. Even if she sacrificed a lot of hours of sleep, she managed to earn enough to move to Tokyo and went from working as a maid to winning an idol contest. But this experience taught her that being an idol wasn't her thing. And She is one of a kind, guys, and you really got to respect everything, you know, that she's gone through, uh, all the hard work that she had to do just to move to Tokyo. Uh, she could have been an idol. Uh, nope, don't want to do that. Uh, you know, it's kind of like a guaranteed uh, paycheck, right? Are you going to be an idol? Okay, well, they would have definitely uh, succeeded with her. Um, but she didn't want to do that. She is loaded with courage. Um, she's such a, a beautiful person, you know what I mean? Inside and out. Uh, she really is. She's loaded, not just with talent but with strength and courage. Um, I respect her in, in every way, shape, or form, guys. She is just amazing. And, you know, Bandmade, man, it's, it's just, I'll never stop reacting to Bandmade, as long as there's stuff to do. Mm. When Miku finally had the opportunity to start her own project and create this miracle band, she had to find a way with the other members to become popular enough to pursue her dream. So she did what she does best, worked harder. Miku invited everyone she knew to the concerts, worked in a noodle cafe, sold tickets by hand, and promoted bandmade as much as possible. Of course, she wasn't alone, as all her bandmates helped to promote their band. But as the creator and public image of bandmade, she gave everything to avoid being disbanded. And all their efforts paid off when they chose to shoot the MV of Thrill instead of Aito Junetsu no Matadoru. This particular choice led to the birth of a fast-growing overseas fan base and a huge boost in their popularity. This was the momentum Bandmade needed to reach the point where they could start to write their own songs and become the hard rocking band that we know today. Without Miku's hard work, her love for made cafes and this idea to mix cool music with cute outfits, band made would never have existed. With the miraculous creation of this impossible band, our five favorite maids continue to pursue the same dream, living as professional musicians and dominating the world through music. 
As long as Bandmade will continue to play their music, we can say that they are making the world a better place. Don't you wanna say it? No. Guys, Orenji has just got the bandmate stuff down. Orenji, you, uh, man, you're doing, you are doing bandmates such a great service, my friend. Thank you so much for these uh, documentaries. They're so fun, so informative. Uh, great respect for you. Great respect for your channel. Um, well, guys, that's another one down. So the tons more bandmate stuff to come. I just figured I'd finish this off for you so you don't have to wait. All right, so have a great day, guys, and we'll see you in the next band-made one.